What do you do when somebody is out of control? How do you companion someone who's angry, who's been waiting too long, you know, whatever it is, who's scared? How do you companion them? And it's very important, really, to, to meet them right where they are and use the same volume of voice that they're using. You know, it sounds very counterintuitive because you want to calm them down. All that does is make them feel worse and misunderstood. And so meeting someone right yeah. where they are, if somebody's yelling, yell with them. What's going on? What's happening to you? Let them tell you and their voice will come right down. And as they come down, you come down. So it's meeting people right where they are, getting to the heart of the matter. What is it? And not what's wrong, but what's going on? What's happening? Tell me. I'm here for you. Instead of trying to suppress them, because that does the absolute opposite. Yeah. I'd love to do yeah, that's, this go out to the police because they need to understand this strategy of companioning in a crisis. Companioning as a de-escalation strategy. Yes. And, and also, you know, meeting them where they're at and using the word what, not why. 